Hello, you. How are you, Asta? Or are you Giganto? Do you want to show the stream what noise Giganto makes? <laughs> oh my good stream. I hope you didn't get too scared from Giganto. He's... He is a bit scary, but are you friendly as well? Yeah. Did you have a nice time? Do you want to tell Papa what we bought? Yeah, we bought glass. <gasps> you Vanilla. Bought... Yeah, what is that in English? I don't know. Vanilla ice cream? Cool. Did you try some? No. Not yet. For dinner? After no, we're, dinner. Having, we're having a bit of lunch and then we'll get some pecan pie. And vanilla ice cream. Oh, oh! They said they they jumped off their chair. They were so scared. Why? Because you did the roar. Why? But I I told them you're friendly. <laughs> Can Papa have a kiss from Gigantu? Thank you. Love you. So Mum is putting on some coffee for you. Oh, what a what a yeah, thank you very much. Are you sure he's friendly? I'm sure, I'm sure. Do you want to Oh, really? Oh my goodness, it's Giganto! <laughs> oh, be calm, Luna! Be calm, Hey, or are you staying for a little bit? Do you want to give Papa a kiss? Or no. Or no. Oh, Just no. a hug. Mm, I love you, Esther Pasta. What's that? What is that? Oh, oh so I'm playing Jap. Uh, they're really fun, yeah. They're really fun. Oh, we've got to go, uh, so what's he playing here? Uh, shall we try some Byzantines, boys? Some Byzantines. Do the new patch have better unit? I think so. I think the new patch is definitely more responsive for sh like, 100%. Now, there's a few ways to play these, I believe, right? Like, you can go, um, Merc build. I've tried the Mercs. Because the two landmarks are very... Access stable contains strength that can be activated. Comes with 30 spot, generates one every 30 seconds. Yeah, I think the Grand Winery is probably better than this Hippodrome thing, but... Hmm. <laughs> but yeah, you can definitely... Like, I can definitely feel that it's like... Less delay than it used to be. It's very nice. Slow movement, it might be that, but... I know I've heard that they have been working on tick rate and stuff. Wait, what was he again? He was uh, Japan. So the olive oil here, you get it by, from berries, shoreline fish, trade, and your equivalent of farms, which is orchards, I believe. Also, every time you build a building, you get eight stone. You can trade oil for mercs as well. Yeah, quite a few things. It's uh, it's it's very interesting.
You can buy and you can trade oil at the market itself. It's very uh, interesting. Put the Grand Winery there. I haven't placed a cistern yet, but it's also it's like five percent. So I'll I'll do it as I finish this, I reckon. But maybe it's worth to just do it initially because it's it's only five percent gathering initially. Tell you what, we'll we'll make we'll make one, we'll make one here, because this is where we'll put all our farms as well, eventually. <laughs> so this will boost uh, all the villagers in this region, like five percent, and increase research speed and that kind of stuff. So I'll put it on. Also, these cisterns, they act with three ways. Conscripto, you can arm villagers. Conscripto, increase their production speed of military. Research rates increase, and then building damage taken decreased. So lots of different things going on there. Yeah, it's like 5% right now. It doesn't feel like a, a lot to me. I might be absolutely wrong. I might be. So it doesn't improve your... <coughs> I think it's just gathering rates. Bless me. Thank you. Thank you. I've got a prop. I'm like pretty sick. Okay, so we can actually get the uh, wheelbarrow nice and quick here. One of my favorite upgrades. Is it worth getting it this fast? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> so he's gone for the farm one. So that means I don't really have to worry too much about uh, the bros here. Mm -hmm. That was close. That was close. Τι how fast does that go? Pretty damn fast, actually. So you can get upgrades real quick. Now again, am I focusing too much on eco right now? Very possibly, very possibly. Okay, so he's got a second town center on the way. So we know we can boom. We can definitely boom a lot, actually. And again, I'm just kind of plonking these around. And we'll, uh, you know what? I should get a cistern over here for this production. Okay, so this is where we get to pick. Do I want Lombomern, Keshik, 
or javelin. Camel right. Camel? I've been very much about the Lombowman one. But Grenadiers, as your final thing, could be very cool. Some damn good AoE in the mix. Hmm. Interesting team. Interesting. <laughs> Tell you what, let's get a... Uh... Oh, can't make that yet. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I'm gonna go... Yeah, I'm gonna go for the... I don't know. I don't know right now. Fuck yeah, okay. Fuck it. Yeah, but we'll go. We'll go for the grenadier one. It's kind of cool. And soon I can actually. Actually, we can get the max uh, cistern thing here, eh? It's kind of nice. I, I think it was absolutely uh, way too greedy. But it's kind of nice to test uh, everything. So remember, this is like boosted our villagers massively now, eh? Okay, and we can... Uh, Javelin throwers, cool. Yeah. Kind of a fun unit to have. Mm. How many javelin throws does it give you? Four. Tell you what, it's not bad. And here we can start switching to like slow orchard, I guess. And yeah, they build fast because of the system. So maybe I didn't need two archer rangers actually. Maybe one would have absolutely done the job. But yeah, this was um, too much emphasis on the cisterns here for me that it doesn't quite pay off for itself. But I kind of knew that when I was doing it. I just wanted to see how it felt, if that makes sense. So the next thing we can get from the military or this is uh, camels. If I continue along this path, which is cool. I tell you what, we are going to be my gathering a lot of food now. So that's cool. Horsemen damage workers versus workers increased by two. Workers killed by a horseman reward 20 gold. It's quite fun. This one seems funny. But I'm not sure which one people are getting. But I, I, I technically already have um, Max Sister, and so yeah, absolutely did this in a, a bonkers way. One, two, three, four. Also, they're cheaper than regular farms. It's kind of cool. Now, we'll need some more wood for a... Uh, some bros. <laughs> oh, 
tell you what, what do we need? Let's get crossbowmen and a blocksmith team. Get some camel riders soon as well. Ah, veteran contract, of course. And yeah, I've just been slowly transitioning to orchard over here. Feels kind of nice. So this produces units just... It does. I tell you what, we can definitely make a blocksmith over there. And because we research giga fast. So we've got this cataphract now. Ooh. Bonjour. Oh. He yeah. Got him. And yeah, we're gonna get camel riders. So if he's got horsemen. Or not horsemen, you know what I mean. That could be very nice. And these upgrade in 17 seconds. Alright, that's 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 good. <laughs> Quinn Chang with the tier one. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Oh, he's coming for my orchard, lads. So what is it? So they get two armor with that thing that I just did. That's kind of cool. Does it make super fast now? Oh. Tell you what. Aha, uh -huh. it doesn't actually give you um, that many camel riders. That's good to know. And what does this do? Cataphracts get plus one armor? That's not bad. For... Actually, it's pretty... I guess it buffs everything a little bit. Oh, we'll, see. we'll see how that goes, actually. That could be kind of fun. We'll plonk it here. And we'll get these guys like this. Uh... So yeah, my cataphracts are going to be big boys. And we're also going to get... Um... All those upgrades online, hopefully. That's what we're hoping for here. Brangian Guard. Now, if I've already got, like, a lot of crossbows in the mix, let's see how this goes. I've got crossbows. I actually have a decent number of camel riders as well. So my army's fairly toxic. To deal with, I mean. And again... We are upgrading very quickly. From having zero upgrades, we've now got all the upgrades. Let's see how this goes for his lads. We'll do the uh, charge through him! <laughs> That's kind of cool. Hmm. So yeah, this is just building random units constantly. Oh, I tell you what, we'll get this. Get these cataphracts with even more armor, right? Could be the key. So what's this? The Dymo Palace. Oh, it's a... Palace. That's actually big. All right, all right. So he does actually have a lot of these uh, super archers, if you can call them that. The uh, horsemen, dudes. We'll get more javelin throw. The javelin throws actually make this so annoying for him to deal with. They really do. Oh, 
And yeah, we're I'm kind of rallied that elsewhere just so I can see what's actually being pumped out of that landmark. Just just for my own kind of peace of mind, if you will. Ooh, that's good. So, so far, it's just absolutely waddling out the uh, javelin throwers. And they're, they're actually quite good right now, so. Oh. Oh! Okay, that's a that's a castle now. So we have to be careful. Oops. Tell you what, shall we go plonk that over there? No more. <laughs> that's the, okay, that, that would be the dumbest location I've ever had for one of those. Just because it was totally unnecessary. But the army's big, man. Okay, well, we'll, we'll try and work up to the next age here. Ooh. So what's this guy? Uh, while trying to limit there is a chat. Yeah, I mean we got to go for the uh, that production, haven't we? That's just too good not to have. Ooh, brutal lads, brutal. Okay, so we actually need to have something in the middle, for sure. Can we do... They're charging. Kind of wonky when you go around trees. Kind of wonky indeed. But yeah, look how much you actually get from um, this landmark. It's not bad at all. It is not bad. Somebody's going to work out the value, and it's good. I think it's going to be good. Good value. Now we can get uh, nasty bees. Always a good unit to have on your side. Oh, you get 32 stone for completing one of those. A mangonel emplacement. Let's go. Trample. Okay, that was slightly underwhelming. Just slightly. Oh shit. Alrighty, alrighty. Time to get some uh, 
elite contract upgrade, so they're all, uh, we can get the big boys. And we'll get, uh, what shall we get? Would regular archers probably be good here? Probably. Oh, what's, why is my cat on my door again? And tell you what. I'm going to get the upgraded version of the Spearman here. And I think I might tr try and uh, get a big old keep there just for protection purposes. <laughs> Bless me. Oh gosh. And we'll get big old cataphracts. Actually, yeah, regular archers got so much wood. Actually, where did I put the uni? Aha. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, he's killing my aqueducts. No. Oops. He's destroying everything. Luckily, they're sort of cheap, so that's good. Okay, we're gonna go for the a few of these things now. They upgrade real fast because we're bison time. And tell you what, oh, we can get grenadiers now. How many does it produce? Just two. Just two. We'll see how it goes. I'm actually kind of excited to see what my army does to him. I feel like it's got a lot of potential. And it produces very quickly as well. Him having these castles available is a big deal. And I will upgrade Varangian Guard. So I would like. Holy fuck. He's got a. Uh, trample. I guess the. You know what? I think the trample thing, actually, for just being able to damage a lot of somebody's army, might be pretty good. And also, you get this thing where it's. Uh, what is it? You make the whole army vulnerable. I just lose both my... I just lost them both for free, didn't I? I certainly did. Oh, and he's got the blow-up dudes. Alright, but my army's pretty strong. But I definitely need more uh, food. Holy shit. He's got a lot of towers. Can they all have rockets? Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Oh, dude, it's uh, of course. It's the map. Wait, can these guys get ball? That'd be sick. Let's check. Oh, 
can we get a royal cannon, actually? That could be cool. That could be cool. Alrighty, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, I definitely should have put this uh, with a sister, eh? Oh, wait, wait, something's still broken. Oh my god, it was this the whole time. So we're getting a lot of stone. Now, you got to remember, like, his, uh... His homies that he's got. Those gun dudes are freaking good. Get another na nasty bee. But this absolutely does turn into a game of like who has the middle. Which we know, we know. We know that. And we'll start moving maybe a bit closer. Although he's got the rocket men, dude. The rocket men are good. Where are my friends there? Like... <laughs> Let's do it like this. They're in there, boys. They're in there. Oh my god, my army's strong. I tell you what, I really love the mix of camel riders. A lot. When I think about it. kind of putting it so you have like and granted there's going to be things that we learn literally every day so i got these bros in shield wall right now and my elite cataphracts they're 510 health oh my god hey <laughs> that's insane i actually thought for a while, second i was going to lose for sure I really did. So let's have a look at the eco. I guess it will... Olive oil. <laughs> I was about to say, I guess it will show olive oil as well, right? Interesting. Yeah, very interesting. 